As ironic as this is, this is the last uh, weekend of fall. What a beautiful fall we have when we're topping it off with a winter storm and all kinds of cold. And next week when we start winter, it's going to get warmer again. That's how it is in the weather business. Well, right now we still have that snow falling. It's mainly just a light snow in some of the uh, southeastern metro, eastern Dakota County, southern Washington County, and into uh, Pierce County of Wisconsin. Some big flakes of snow coming down from what we've heard. Uh, out west, uh, we're starting to see the development of the storm coming in already around Mitchell, South Dakota. We're seeing the first of the snow. Uh, winter storm warning goes into effect at noon today. I think realistically, though, here in the Twin Cities, 1 or 2 o'clock is when we'll start to get the snow here in the metro from that. And it'll continue. I think the most intense snow will be tonight, 6 p.m. to midnight. It'll still be around tomorrow. And again, the entire southern half of Minnesota, including the Twin Cities, 6 to 10 inches of snow or more, and also the entire western part of Wisconsin. Uh, we're also looking Looking at the winds to kick up late tonight. I think late tonight and tomorrow, the biggest problem is going to be blowing and drifting snow in the open areas. And then behind all that, butt kicking cold. After a high today of 15 above, temperatures falling to 5 below tomorrow. And Sunday, we wake up to 20 below with a wind chill of minus 40. Wind chill warnings are out. 9 below the high on Sunday, and then the big warm up. Right now in the Twin Cities, WCCO temperature 8 above, the wind chill minus 3.